from various universities, colleges, and other educational institutes, our revered faculty members, respected non-teaching staff, their fellow research scholars, and their PG students. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. And a very good morning to all of you. It's with immense pleasure, pride, and profound sense of gratitude that I, Firdos Ahmed, welcome you all to this heartwarming and historic occasion, the Alumni Meet 2025 of the Department of Chemistry, University of Kashmir. It is with a full heart that I welcome you all back, not just to the campus, but to the place each one of us at some point of time called home. The place where ideas were born, dreams were shaped, and memories were itched into time. Today is not merely a reunion, it is a return, a return to corridors where footsteps once hurried between lectures, where ideas sparked over lab benches, where the scent of chemicals and chalk still lingers in our memory and where inbuilt pressure made us resilient like diamond. It is truly a moment of pride and joy to see so many of our esteemed alumni gathered here, coming home to the place that shaped their journeys. To our esteemed alumni, your return is not just symbolic, it is deeply uh, meaningful. You are living legacy and ambassadors of this department, spreading its spirit across the globe. Your achievements in academia industry and beyond fills us with pride and serve as a testament to the strength of the education that you received from this place. Dear alumni, your continued connection with us through your accomplishments and guidance remains our greatest strength. Let this meet be an opportunity to share experiences, rekindle old connections and explore new ideas for strengthening the bridge uh, between our alumni and the department. I would like to tell here that we aspire to establish a vibrant chemical chemistry alumni association that strengthens connection between the alumni and our institution. This network will facilitate knowledge exchange, provide mentorship, and other valuable guidance to the students in their academic and professional journeys. Additionally, we aim to promote the visits of the students from colleges and schools to our department and interaction of our PG and research students with the UG and school children for fostering a deeper interest in chemistry as a subject. By reinforcing these ties, we seek to create a lasting legacy of support, growth, and popularization of chemistry for future generations. Equally important is our vision to harness alumni contribution to support underprivileged students in our department as well as in the institution that our alumni represent. I look forward to your continued support in making this vision a reality. An afternoon session is dedicated to outlining the modalities of framing this association. I hope you all will participate and contribute your ideas for this noble cause. Now, about this alumni, this <coughs> alumni connect actually, we became conscious after it was uh, introduced as a, as a key indicator in the NAC assessment. There is one uh, key indicator, 5.4, which pointedly asks a question. How does the institute benefit from the alumni? Or how does the alumni contribute to the uh, development and growth of the institution? Uh, although we are relatively new to it, but Alumni Connecting is a success story in the best. Uh, I mean, I can give you a few examples. For example, the Harvard University uh, generates on an average $1.3 billion uh, in donations. Major part of it comes from alumni. But the uh, alumni of that university have a combined wealth of exceeding $5,000 billion, $5 trillion. Okay, the Indian economy has just crossed four trillion. So the combined wealth of one university in U.S. is more than the uh, more than uh, all of Indian economy. Okay, so that's the kind of similarly Princeton University, which is actually the highest that is uh, getting the uh, uh, in terms of alumni contribution, 
gets on an average $75 million every year from alumni contribution alone. There is another of an alumnus who talked about uh, the type of courses that are in demand in the West, right? So if you introduce these courses, th this kind of a course or this kind of a course, there is more chance of finding a job in the West. So that is also what we can learn from the, um, from the alumni who are well placed. And I see uh, many uh, uh, locals particularly which are here and who can guide us a lot in, uh, in many ways so with their engagement, not necessarily monetarily, uh, but in kind, in the sense that uh, they can help us uh, grow and improve our standards in many ways. So that is the kind of thing. When I was a proctor and during that period, the students will always come with some complaints from different departments. Believe me, honestly, in five years, I have not seen any single chemistry student come to with a complaint. <laughs> and now I am the registrar of the university. So many departments come to me with a complaint. And believe me, I have not seen any single complaint coming from the head of the department. <laughs> yes, he recently visited my office, but just for the transfer of one of the options. That's not a complaint. That's what he is supposed to do, and that's what I am supposed to listen. Now, coming back to this alumni, this is one of the great connect. It should be there. My uh, colleague, my friend, Professor Mandur Saab, has told you a very uh, important thing regarding this alumni. We need this connect. I'm sure that this department has a very rich connectivity with this alumni. I could see uh, the very uh, worthy people here sitting of the dais. It's because that they have been the alumni of this department and they have, they have had so many prestigious positions in their career, whether in academia, whether in non-academia offices. But they have a very high reputation in the public circles. Believe me honestly. So, as far as the infrastructure of this department is concerned, this is the best. We have always the departments with uh, buildings housing two departments. This is the only building where we have only have one department. That's the case. <laughs> so this speaks volumes together. And then going to the instrumentation part. You have a very, um, very excellent grants coming from different agencies. Yeah, one thing I want to also tell you that. We have a very excellent faculty from one to top in the department. And then uh, because of that excellent faculty, so we have the grants coming up and I urge, I request my colleagues, whatever they have done, there is always a scope to improve. And the students, I always praise. Uh, I, I see always one student who is always coming very early in the morning and moving very late in the evening. He seems to be the department of the chemistry student. He, he was just moving, he may be from Ladakh. Yes. Because I have always seen him 24 into 7, every time. So like him, we have all the very good students, very reputed students. The world is open for you. And I was very happy to listen that our alumni is working from the globe. We have very highly talented scholars working all over, the, not only in the country, but throughout the world. The Professor Ajah Saab just told, that, just told us that their uh, number of PhD students are working in good institutes throughout the uh, country. As uh, you know, my earlier speakers have said uh, that alumni meet has an important, uh, you know, uh, goal to achieve, and I'm sure uh, definitely university is moving ahead in order to achieve that goal. Almost, I think all our departments have conducted at least one uh, alumni meet uh, a year, and uh, of course some of the points which were raised that we should have more connection with the alumni. I believe in that and uh, you know uh, money is not uh, very important. Money is also important if we can raise some scholarships for the poor students that would be really good but you know having uh, their advices uh, how they can contribute to the department by their expertise, by their scientific temperament, how they can contribute to the department. We should definitely do that uh, connect. And uh, somebody was saying that uh, definitely Professor Mushtaq Siddiqui Saab
can uh, further uh, give his inputs, which should be seen if they are, uh, we can work on them, definitely we should do that. Uh, everyone said Department of Chemistry is one of the best departments. Uh, my feelings are also same, my observations are also same. It's one of the best, I one of the best departments. I best not best so it's uh, really one of the best departments. Uh, definitely, as is such complaint, we don't receive from your uh, department, but at the same time, uh, we are very cooperative to, uh, to your department from administration. You know, we don't keep any file pending, even funding, you know, very liberal funding we give for the equipment because we know that it's a very base uh, sub scientific subject for the students where they need to, you know, have that technical know-how, research know-how, so we don't even, uh, you know, we try to give the liberal funding and anything, even for the maintenance and all that, the whole department has changed this year. I'm so happy about it. Definitely, you know, uh, with the involvement of all the faculty when they contribute to the system, I'm happy about that. The head department, the dean, they involve everyone in the uh, you know uh, development of the department. That's very important. They have got good projects. Uh, apply for many more uh, you know uh, funding, and definitely I think you will get it. Uh, department of Chemistry, of course, it has had a very uh, good, glorious past. Uh, Professor Afak Sabte, uh, Professor Kaliku Zamante, and you know, my two colleagues sitting over here, Professor Afaka, you know, I'll share my personal, uh, you know, relations with him. Uh, when, you know, thoda sa uh, itna busy nahi hote the on the campus, ghar mein hote the, you know, he would invite me for a cup of tea. Wo chai ke liye to kisi ko nahi bulate the, but definitely he would invite me for a cup of tea. Very unke saath jo mental wavelength thi bahut achhi banti thi. You know, he would come with us for a picnic kabhi aise karke and uh, really I have great respect for him. Allah Taala unko jannatul firdos ata kare. Main, maine isliye bola ki, you know, is type, is caliber ke, you know, jo scientific temperament unko nao baje tak bahar agar goliyan chal rahi hoti thi, you would be in his lab, you know. Uh, is type of temperament, tha, is type of dedication. Thi. We really salute uh, such people who have contributed to the uh, system of the, to the development of the uh, university, to the research development of the university. And definitely, uh, you know, even at present, we have very good faculty in the Department of Chemistry. I'm sure by their contribution, it will move more ahead where the administration can help, will definitely do it. Uh, prepare yourself, present it as one of the best departments for the NAC. We are looking forward that, uh, towards that, inshallah. And uh, this Alumni Connect should become more stronger. Your presence has truly elevated the spirit of this gathering. Your inspiring words have rekindled our re connection to our roots and reminded us all the legacy we share as members of this great institution. My thanks to guest of honor, the Dean of the Faculty, Professor Manzoor Ahmed Malik. We are grateful for his gracious presence and valuable insights. Your continued dedication to academic excellence is a source of motivation of both alumni and current students. A sincere thanks to our respected registrar, Professor Nasir Iqbal, who served as a patron of this meet your constant support and encouragement has been instrumental in bringing this event to life. A special thanks to all our respected faculty members and staff who have been the guiding lights behind the success story of every student present here today. Your tireless dedication continues to shape the future. To our dear alumni, this day belongs to you. Thank you for taking time out of your busy lives to reconnect, remains, and rejoice in the memories that life uh, that tie us all together. Your journeys inspire our current students and reinforce the strength of the foundation of this department. I also extend my appreciation to the students, volunteers, and supporting staff for their relentless efforts in making this event seamless and memorable. 
Lastly, thank you to everyone who joined us today. Your presence made this gathering special. Let's carry the spirit of unity and pride forward. And may we continue to grow as a strong and connected alumni family.